Hello, I'm image consultant Susan Bigsby at SusanBigsby.com. In this clip, we're going to show you how to tie a necktie. Steve, you've yeah. got a beautiful tie on today. Thank you. What you're going to start out doing is to put the tie around your neck and make sure that the shorter, smaller, thinner end of the tie is on the left-hand side of your body and just a little bit shorter than this button here at the, in the middle of your stomach. Go ahead, put the longer side over the top of the shorter side, pull it up and around. You want to hold the tie. Once you put the tie back be around, you want to hold the tie in front so that you have a loop already in the making here. When you pull the larger side back through, pull it through that loop that you've been holding with your fingers, flatten out the tie so there are no bumps and lumps, pulling the tie through, and you can slide that knot right up to the throat so easily and position it nicely where you want it at the throat. Now the main thing is that you want the bottom of the tie to be in the middle of the belt buckle. You never want it too high and you never want it too long. Then you may want to button, you can button it before if you want or you can wait until after you've tied the tie to, to button the top button and adjust the collar down over the tie. And this collar is quite nicely starched. And it may be actually easier to button the collar after you, which I'll let Steve do. It may be easier to do after he's buttoned his, uh, folded his collar down. Okay, very nice. When you're choosing a tie, you always want to choose a tie that pops. Never choose something that's a little bit more dull or uninteresting. When you're putting yourself together, you always want to make sure you're coordinated. You may want to coordinate your tie to the color of the shirt. You have many, many options, but make sure it's always interesting and looks fabulous against your coloring. This is Susan Bigsby. Thank you so much for watching.